Hey, it's Kristen here. Um, today I'm actually going to be sharing with you guys two bags by Coach and the story behind this bags. Um, well, my personal experience, that's why I mean story. So this first one I'm going to show you. So this is actually the Chase bag, the small one. Ta -da. This one I got from Nordstrom. I purchased this a while back. Um, it did take a while to ship out. Um, there was sort of a disappointments on just placing the order because I actually ordered two of the same color, which is the, uh, I believe, Dark Pebble is the name of the color. Um, I ordered one of, one of the style Chase and one of the other style was Kip. And after like a couple of days, like the order has been placed and all that stuff, they were being processed. I got an email confirmation stating that a refund has been processed. And I'm like, what? Why? And then I checked online and it says that the bag cannot be fulfilled because it's out of stock and which was the kit. And I don't mind. I mean, I, I don't mind it now, but I did mind it then. I was really disappointed because I really wanted the bag in that color especially after receiving this in the package because the color is so stinking gorgeous like normally i wouldn't cut out the tags after receiving the package because normally i would sit down and really think thoroughly if i want to keep it or not but this one i had to cut it i had to cut it immediately and use it this very same day um so i've used this bag once since i got it the only concern I have with this one, or the only comment, is that the stitching, because I actually look at stitching of the bags, the stitching on this bag in particular um, is not that great. I mean, there's no loose threads or anything, but definitely on the back of the bag, you will see that it wasn't consistent. Um, yeah, I don't know if you could see that here, but that's definitely not consistent the stitching is not um, perfect. Now I'm not saying it should be perfect, but I'm saying it should be consistent um, because I'm gonna show you the other bag in the stitching as well. Now the color is just the perfect taupe, the perfect gray. It goes so well with like just a simple long sleeve striped white, black and white striped shirt, whatever, sorry, <laughs> dark blue jeans and your boots. Typical, um, outfit for fall and then just throw this on and then just look put together like it's just so amazing and i love how it doesn't have the seat it just the sort this oval and then the turn the turn lock that's just so beautiful it kind of resembles the design um of hermes the evelyn bag but i think this one is definitely much better i'm not a fan of the h on the hermes but this one is so cute um so i did order this from nordstrom and the app pictures on Nordstrom are very, very accurate um, compared to Macy's because I actually went to Macy's because I love this so much and I've been eyeing on the other color and I couldn't find it anywhere else but Macy's. So I don't often shop at Macy's. The last time I've been to Macy's was 2018, but I went today so I can get that color, the bag in that color. So this is the, the dark... Uh, sorry <laughs> this is a dark pebble tongue twisted here and then this is in the color what color are you flax the color is flax Ta-da! i was afraid it was going to be an ugly yellow but no this is like the perfect yellow it's not i guess it's mustard yellow huh and this was on clearance too so Here's the price tag for you. Yep, it was on clearance. And then I'm gonna show you the stitching on this one. If you compare it to the other one, this one has a cleaner finish here. That's just, yeah. So it's the same design and everything. Um, same size, of course. So the only difference is that, of course, the color. The color of the hardware on this one is the rustic gold, and this one is more like just dark. I guess it's black hardware. Um, and then the only way you know that this is Coach is by knowing that it's Coach. I mean, if you follow the the trend or the style 
in the design of coach then you know it's coach um but i'm not a fan of coach these are the only coach designs that i actually like um and i've been eyeing on a pillow tavi i do want to get a pillow um what's that design i forgot is it pillow cassie oh my gosh i'm so sorry because i don't think it's pillow cassie i think cassie 19 is what i wanted um i know pillow tabby is one of the ones i wanted and pillow something i forgot what the other one i'm talking about but anyways these are one of the things i really liked because it didn't really show anything that it's coach unless you know it's coach and besides the charms that's dangling right there that you can detach um then you would know it's coach but who's gonna go whoa that's coach you know what i mean but yes i do love these two very simple um obviously i do like it because when i am so happy about this bag i decide to you know what i'm gonna go drive down to macy's and get this color and i'm so glad i did because this was the last one too um so i'm gonna show you the interior of the dark pebble so you open that up it's just basically one huge compartment with a back pocket and take out the strap i just did my nails so i'm very careful it's not that i'm careful of the bag but i'm careful of my nails so you get the back pocket and then the little things that it comes with so basically the tag and the qr code for care care instructions so which is a good thing that they do that so they just give you a qr code instead of having like the whole packet and waste of um paper because nobody really looks into that and plus it's not really an authentication or anything and then you get just one crossbody strap so this one the only issue that i have on this one is that see once you adjust the strap it will show the history of the adjustment so it just stays there and i've tried to stretch it out it still sits there all curved up kind of bothers me but oh well i do like the bag anyway um i do wish though like on the punctures there would be hardware i like those things it makes it look cool if you know what i mean i'm talking about like the metal hardware the ring that goes on there i wish they had it they had it on some of their bags and i wish these had them i feel like it should come automatic for most of the um designer bags but yeah so that's that and then there's no back pocket like I said earlier, um, Nordstrom did have an accurate image of their product because if you go on Macy's, um, if you look through the pictures of this bag, um, it shows that there was a back pocket, but the back pocket is only for the bigger size, not the small ones. But yeah, I didn't realize that until I read the comments and I'm like, oh yeah, that's so true. Because when I bought this, I'm like, I don't remember seeing a picture I had a back pocket but then on macy's i do remember seeing a picture and then they read the comments or the reviews like pictures are inaccurate i mean it would be nice if it had a back pocket but again it is a very precisely small bag like it's very petite so having like a small back pocket zipper back pocket may not be too functional however if it was like a slid pocket maybe it would have been a good idea um so again it comes with the strap um and it's still attached um since it's the last one it was on display so again you'd see the history of the adjustments and i'm just gonna have to live with that and then it's a turn lock front pocket and just like that nice and clean again i'm very careful because i just did my nails and it's a dark color too so if i do dent it it's gonna be too obvious um, and I made my comment about, um, dust bags before that coach doesn't have the best dust bag. I think that they need to step up with their dust bag game. Um, I think like Michael Kors and coach has the same type of dust bags and Kate Spade has better dust bag. Like I want to buy, uh, Kate Spade earlier. And then I saw their dust bags and I'm like, that is so much better than coach like i kid you not it's it, i don't know i it just bothers me like i just bought a bag from coach and this is the quality of the bag the dust bag that i'm gonna get 
I mean, I feel like it should should have been a thicker material. But all, oh well, dust bag's purpose is to protect the bag from the dust, right? But at the same time, I do know if, that some of the dust bags are actually made in a certain material so that you can use that to really clean the, the exterior of the bag. So these ones will not be a good material to wipe over your coach bags. Um, anyways, like Tory Burch, the interior of the Tory Burch, you can use that to clean or dust off your bag. This one, it's just silk, so I don't know. Anyways, let's go back to the bag. Um, um, again, it's the same interior. Now this one's all yellow. And it does have the Coach branding all over it. And then back pocket, and then the little care card with the QR Ooh! with the QR code. Sorry, I felt like I scratched my nail into the zipper. But anyways, and then got this one, which is very important for every bag. <laughs> yeah, and that's pretty much it. That's all I have for you guys is just to show you this too and how much I love this one so much that I couldn't wait for the other color and then we just went to the store and got it so the story on this one was basically um not being able to get the other design or the other style of the same color man the stitching really bothers me but they're out of stock so if you do like this color though um I did go online and really looked where you can find them so no, they're no longer available on Coach website. They're not available on Nordstrom either. Um, but they are available in Bloomingdale's. I just checked it today. So if you do like this color, I which I highly recommend. Yes, this this is a really good color. You should get this one. They are still available in Bloomingdale's. Um, this one, um, I do know that this color is still available in Saks Fifth Avenue. So you can go on that uh, website. And then, what else? So the story on this one, I'm not really too happy about my experience at Macy's. Again, like I told you earlier, I don't shop at Macy's. Um, there's just something about Macy's I don't like. Um, I guess the Macy's I go to or the Macy's that we have here, they only use plastic bags. And no matter what you're buying from them, they're only going to put it in plastic bags. Then I asked for a box and then they just handed me a box. They didn't even put my bag in the box. So it was just kind of like, um, a poor um, quality service, if you know what I mean. But I really wanted the bag anyway, so. Um, it's not like you've not seen this bag anywhere else, but I'm going to go give you a 360 again of that color. And I'm going to give you of an idea of what it fits in the bag. So again, this is the charm, detachable charm, and then a heat, heated stamped coach. And it's the same one on the other one. They have a burgundy one too on Macy's. They still have this one on Macy's um, website, I believe. But again, I'm not sure how much they have left because it says low in stock. Um, and then the reason I actually went to the store and got the bag because I wanted to see how the yellow tone looks like. And when I saw it, I said, that is it. They're coming home with me. So with what fits in the bag, I'm gonna use the taupe to show y'all. Um, basically, I have this pouch that I put most of my stuff. I'm gonna just slide that. Wait, do I use this? Um, did I use this last? Time? I don't remember using it last time. But I use this for my my. Um, what do I have in here? These are essentials, you guys. I just don't want to say out loud what I have in here. But these are my essentials. Some of them are my pens and my markers. So just to see, just to show, show you. It doesn't fit. If I try to put it sideways, it still doesn't fit. So I think I remember removing the essentials here and just stuffing it in the pocket. So, um, wow, this is such a bad, um, um, <clears throat> bad video for what fits in the bag. So sorry, you guys. I'm doing my best here because my nails. Um, okay, so let's start with. <gasps> So sorry. All right, so let's start with what I actually bring with me. So recently, I celebrated my birthday about two, three weeks ago. It's not even too recent, but I still have gift cards I have yet to use. So I just put them whenever I transfer them. 
Yeah, you can get more orange juice. You can ask daddy. That's my daughter. Um, so I'm just going to go throw in my other pouch, which has my car keys. And then my, my card holder. My lotion. Jeez, Christine, stop. I worked hard on these nails. So sorry, you guys. Commercial here. Commercial break. Ah. Not really, because I'm not. Okay, and then my favorite color, my favorite lipstick from Dior right now. So it just goes in there. My AirPods. Um, extra car keys, actually, because I bring my car keys and my husband's car keys, just in case we need to switch cars from time to time. House keys. And there you have it. And then occasionally we'll be wearing my, oh my, my. My, my eyeglasses so here's that and if not my eyeglasses with my sunglasses so I still have room to like stuff in my markers and my other cards and other things but you see that's what you have in there so they fit my phone still fits here I wish I had a I'm so sorry you guys you're seeing my raw reaction of me damaging my freshly done nails ah oh well and then zip it up Ta -da! see it doesn't even like bulk up like that so it still keeps its structure Ta -da! i really like this bag um but yeah you want to see if the how it looks with this strap attached to it Y'all, I'm doing this video with my freshly done nails because I just wanted to get it done and post it up so that you guys can get the bag while it's still available in the market. Y'all, because if you're debating of getting the bag, let me tell you, the size is perfect. I am five foot short again. I've been saying that. And this one falls right at my hip. cha -da! It is so stinking cute. Like, I kid you not. I love this bag. This was just so... It was too pretty to pass. Honestly, don't sleep on it. It's too pretty to pass. Um, and then this one is on sale. It's also on sale at Zach's Fifth Avenue. Um, but I believe it's cheaper at Macy's. So go on Macy's. And this one is regular price at um, Bloomingdale's. So, yeah. I suggest and highly recommend this color. I really love this bag. If you're thinking about it, don't think about it. Just go add to cart, check out, ship it, go. Yeah, get it, get it, get it, get it. But anyways, without anything else to say, I hope you guys did like this video and you find it helpful. And again, my name is Chrissy. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you. Bye.